think somebody stepped on his shoe and he's slow getting back because it's partially off as Gurley misses the jumper and the tip taken away by Abercrombie. Barnes is just now getting back down the floor. He had to stop and put the shoe up. You're right, Ron. He did lose part of that shoe and he got back in, fortunately, just in time. But I'm still a little disappointed at Calvin Curry, number 44 for Oklahoma. His job is to look to put the ball in the basket. He's not even looking at the hoop. 26 points by Miner. Ryan Miner's doing a fantastic job of scoring, but he has to have some help from his teammates.
penetration occur and still play the zone defense, but you have to find someone in position. Fowler unlucky on that one. Abercrombie back out to Anches. And the French with the rebound. Maiden still on the bench. He picked up his fourth foul about three and a half minutes ago. Rafe LaFrance just came up with his eighth rebound of the game. And for the first time in a long time, Oklahoma is below 50% shooting from the field. Well, Kansas is not number one in the country for, for nothing. Shot clock is down to one. Vaughn, and he touches nothing. Another violation. And the Oklahoma fans are really rewarding their team for the great defense. That's fantastic defense by Oklahoma. They're playing a zone, and they're denying the penetration of Chuck Vaughn. And in doing so, they're containing the inside, giving the guys on the perimeter nowhere to pass inside. the sideline talking with his coaches and also with the players saying hey that's two shot clock violations on as many trips we can't let that happen Fires for three more if you're going to force a turnover you want to score points off of it you have to make your opponent pay for that mistake we're tied as we go under four minutes maintain body control on the baseline after the collision and still knock it down. That's a sign of an excellent scorer who has the ability to concentrate. Oh! Abercrombie gets that long carry. Samson, Kelvin Sampson on the sideline is saying, spread the floor. Abercrombie. And Oklahoma ties again, this time at 69. By spreading the floor, what they're doing is taking the size advantage from Kansas away from the basket, getting some isolation, one-on-one -on -one type plays. Pollard from point blank range. We now have had five ties and 10 lead changes in this basketball game. Scott Pollard at six foot 10 has Ernie Abercrombie at six four and a half trying to stop him. No way is that going to work. Abercrombie misses but gets his own follow and misses again. And that time unlucky and a whistle and a foul and it's gonna be on Abercrombie. Twice the ball was inside the rim. They weren't able to get it to go through the net, but you have to love the hustle by Ernie Abercrombie trying to fight his way inside the trees. Take a look at the first time. He kind of spins it up there a little quick because he wanted to try to avoid the shot block, and the second time he goes with a leaner and a finger roll, still couldn't get it to go, but he still tried to stay after that ball. Great hustle. You can see he, uh, he wound up making the tackle on the play, <laughs> but it also cost him a foul, and his head coach has to be concerned at the fact that he had shoulder surgery back on November the 4th, went through rehab and played again on December the 3rd. Sean Pearson had an awfully quiet evening. Tonight he has not been to the free throw line, but only two out of four from the field. Been struggling as of late against Oklahoma in the first meeting earlier this season. Only two points, one out of 13 from the field. Pearson misses it. OU touched it last. Minor on the floor. And a timeout. As he's lying on his back, he calls an Oklahoma timeout. Let's take it with him. I love it. It is KU by a pair. They trailed by as many as 13 points in the first half. It was a 10-point OU lead at halftime. Then the KU came storming back. They went up by as many as four points in this half. And now it is 71-69. KU on top with two minutes and 20 seconds to play. Anches. Unlucky on the shot. On the floor. Bothered by Abercrombie. And a whistle and a foul on Pollard. Loose ball foul on Scott Pollard. But excellent hustle by Oklahoma to stay after this loose ball. 
Davis is going to take this shot, but just don't give up on the ball. Ernie Abercrombie, once again, is continuing to work. He's doing a great job at hustling after losing.